Hello everyone and welcome to my newest etch LP, LP which is uh, Lee Long Stitch Trouble in Paradise. We're going to get straight into it. This is a game for the PS1. Uh, this is the PAL version. The PAL version is called Trouble in Paradise uh, for, you know, unknown licensing reasons. Who knows? Anyway, this is the first cutscene. Lag, lag, sort of, sort of. This is my game disc, so uh, that might explain the, well, the absence of, I don't know. Anyway, yeah, it's, just, it's just a bit glitchy. Anyway, so this is a PS1 game released in 2002, created by Blitz Games and, like, Disney something. Anyway, um, the aim of the game is to collect these things called, uh, like, things for per, per level, depending on what, like, boss or whatever it is. Um, it depends on which... Uh, things so like in the first sort of section of the game the first four levels you need to collect uh, 16 photographs anyway circle is to do an attack with Lilo you play as both Lilo and Stitch um, and yeah um, you can do many abilities here there's a hundred of these things to collect I'm not gonna be bothered collecting them I don't care if Ratchet 5 collects them in his upcoming LP of this game but I wanted to upload this before he did because I came up with the idea a while ago um, Anyway, my brother's just in the background. Uh, give me a second. Anyway, okay. Continuing on. Yep, uh, X and Circle does a bum bash. I mean, yeah, what what a, a great name to call it. Uh, I guess they can't call it ass bash or ass pound or whatever. Anyway, these enemies are pain pain in the ass because the control for this, for this game is a bit clunky in terms of attacking, especially with, uh, especially with Stitch, uh, Lilo, whatever. Anyway, these... Things up here are like they, um, what are they, like photographs, uh, things that unlock uh, like secrets in the game. Uh, not secrets, um, like you know, cutscenes, stuff like that. I can't show the cutscenes in this game that aren't part of the movie. Like, I can't show the movie cutscenes because otherwise I will get sued my ass off and Disney will hunt me down and kill me. Um, so, yeah, anyway, three or four. This is a pretty easy game. It, uh, uh, and musically, um, as people know, I like to talk about music a lot in this game, uh, in games. Uh, the music's pretty much shit. Like, it's horrible. Like, I mean, you know, it's, it's decent. It's, it's decent. It suits the game, if you know what I mean. Um, anyway, uh, that's the first level done. I don't care about that 100 out of 100 uh, star pedals. I don't give a shit about it. There's no point uh, getting them. I don't think it really does anything. I'm just doing a run through this game, because this will be the first uh, Let's Play this on YouTube. Anyway, um, the loading takes a while, unfortunately. Uh, anyway, now we're in the next like sub area. Anyway, what's going to be here is we're going to fight like a mini boss. You fight a mini boss pretty much every single level, and you get this sort of cool music here. No, I don't know. It's actually shit. I really shouldn't. Yeah. Okay, so all you have to do with this is just you know he'll shoot you. Oh, I got hit. That is very rare of me. Uh, and then you pretty much just hit him when he when he goes out like this. Watch. Like that, it's pretty simple. Um, yeah, it's a pretty repetitive game. It's pretty much a Crash Bandicoot ripoff, especially when you play a Stitch, if you ask me. Um, but I'll talk more about this in the next part. In the next part, um, which will happen once I beat this boss, we're gonna we're gonna be I'm gonna be having my first ever co-commentary, and that's gonna be with Mal Mal Club Two, great YouTuber, good friend, uh, Max Gruber, as he's known as. Um, so anyway, there we go, boss defeated, and so thanks for watching you guys, thanks for watching the first part of my new LP, and I'll see you in the next part when we go to another level. See you later.